So from way back in the first phase of the project, we were just starting to find out how this worked with putting professional artists into these um, education centres. Since then, I would say that the experiences and the expertise of the professional artists and the teachers have really grown and built, so we're finding lots of interesting and engaging ways to bring art into the classroom, but also ways to bring the young people out of the classroom into galleries and sculpture parks and the theatre, um, lots of different cultural experiences that maybe weren't available to them before. They've really taken to the um, having the artists coming in and they now actually ask what's happening next, what are we doing for our next project, which is, which is really good. I think with um, some of the students, they, they are beginning to engage more with other subjects as well. Um, it certainly helps them to um, come into school when they know that they're going to be doing a subject that they really enjoy um, and that sometimes is the motivating factor in, in them coming in and engaging with, with other things too. Horizon 2020 has had a massive impact on the whole culture of our school and how we've embraced the arts and as soon as you walk in it feels it feels like a creative school. So we've recently found out that we've been awarded Artsmark Gold at Greenwood School which we are really proud of. It's a, it's a real prestigious mark and we've worked for the last two years using lots of Horizon 2020 input and artists to become at that level where we've achieved. Supporting young people to learn through the arts and culture offers them so many opportunities to learn about themselves, to develop hard skills and soft skills. The development that they'll experience and the self-esteem and pride that can come through working in that way, taking risks, trying something new, all of that has, is are really powerful outcomes to experience. So yeah, this project has been um, great for the students um, and I've seen a massive like, improvement in their behaviour and their confidence um, and the artists have really inspired me as well um, and I don't know what I would do without this project. We had a particular student who um, engaged fully throughout and he made some beautiful glass and some ceramics. He's one of these students who has really grown. At first he was really shy um, and then he was able to speak fully about what he'd done and how it helped him. And to be able to talk about it was something incredible for him because he'd never done anything like that before. The summer term, I've learnt so much from it. I was able to feed back to our coordinator here at 2020 what I needed more specifically from the artist on a personal level as well as an artistic level, and it has delivered so well. I feel like I've, I've engaged with it more, which allows me to pass that engagement on to the students. And I, I think I'm feeling very hopeful about what's going to happen in year three and how far that's going to go and, you know, learning from what's happened in year two and positive things taking those forwards and things that weren't so positive trying to change them um, and and also just not being afraid to go never tried that before let's have a go and see what happens 